Now, the Pabst Theater is hosting its first shows this weekend since the pandemic began, but it's still waiting on critical money from the federal government to help keep its doors open. Cassidy Williams is live with more on why things are again delayed. Well, unfortunately, the Pabst Theater is all too familiar with delays. The John McGivern show that's happening this weekend was originally a Christmas show pushed back to start yesterday. Now, while the show is now moving forward, the theater is still waiting for critical federal money. You can Thank you for coming. As the Paps Theater's house manager, Catherine Bergman, is in charge of making sure a show runs smoothly start to finish. It's a big thing is the customer service to make sure we take care of the patrons so they're all set. You can exit Bye -bye. right out there. Bye. She's back at her post Saturday after coming. more than a year. <laughs> the theater hosting its first show since the shutdown last March with limited capacity. It's awesome. We're all glad to be back. It's the people that keep Bergman going. But after hundreds of shows were canceled in 2020, Paps Theater Group leaders say it's money that's needed to keep the business going. The sooner it gets here, the better we'll all be. The theater is eligible for a shuttered venue operators grant, a program passed by Congress in December to give billions to save stages across the country. But when the portal to apply for the money opened on April 8th, it almost immediately crashed. I would say deflating would be an understatement. The portal was scheduled to reopen Saturday, but was again postponed Friday night. Thank you for coming. You. Bergman hoping the money comes soon to keep the people flowing through. So that's the main thing is just getting to see everyone. The portal is now set to reopen on Monday at 11 a.m. Live in Milwaukee, Cassidy Williams, Fox 6 News.